Some golf courses are very difficult to film and make look amazing. This one? Not so much. Let's do it, and let's do it now. Rich, have you filled our card in yet? Yeah. We've That's got eight. Should, how many have we got? We've eight on every hole. Yeah, that should, that should do all right, shouldn't it? Yeah. Team one. Huddersfield. Yeah. <laughs> how many of them? Sorry? How many? Listen, I've written it down right there. So right, so, so I'll close that now. What, what, and I won't open that until you... So we've done... What's your name? Hmm? So, welcome to Royal Dornock. And I think it's fair to say this place looks pretty cool, doesn't it, Rich? Fantastic. Rich, how are you? Very good, very good. Very good. Paul, how are you? I'm good, thank you. And today we have a very, very, very special episode for you. This is a For the Love of Golf episode, which meets sort of play for a pint episode. A real quick bit about the format we're playing today guys we are playing four ball better ball so two scores out of the four to count and there's four guys behind us and this is a bit of a north south divide this is north the south pretty much huddersfield versus london but there's four pints on the line so guys make sure you hit those comments below what do you think we're going to score two out of four to count stableford we're going to play full handicap as well i'm playing off scratch paul what are you playing off 10. 10. Paul's playing off 10, Richard's playing off 15, and Adam is playing off scratch. So Rich, I've asked them to comment below what is a good score, four ball, better ball, two to count. What do you think we're going to get? Between six and eight a hole. Six <laughs> What a golf shot. You're right. I, I discovered something in the net during the half-time interval. Oh, right. Hang on. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, well, uh, take your medicine. Oh, So just to put into context why we're here, what we're doing up here, we're here to play golf. We are here at Royal Dawn. We flew up to Inverness last night and we played the Stewie. Stewie? Struey? Struey. Struey. We played the Struey course this morning with quite a bit of a hangover. I'm not going to lie. <sighs> James wasn't in a very good mood this morning, but, but we've had a pint of Guinness. We've had some lunch. I've discovered something in the swing actually, in the net. It's feeling good. How are you boys feeling? Yeah, good. Living the dream? Better than I did first thing this morning. Yes. I think I should practice more often. Oh.
So a couple of holes in, absolutely loving this place. What a golf course this is. The hangover's disappeared, the golf's pretty good. We've hit every green in regulation so far, and if things couldn't get any better, What do they say? When in Rome? Hmm. Oh, that's sugary. Realistically, there's only one thing that could make this day even better. I think we're a couple better than par. Are we a couple better than par? Are we doing all right? Two under fives. Two under fives, two under fives. Guys, if you haven't done already, hit those comments below. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Two scores out of four to count around Royal Dornock. And I've just missed my first green, but I'm putting it down to a bad club. Because it obviously can't have been my fault. Oh yes, it was. <laughs> So, we rejoined the action on the 10th hole. It's still raining a little bit, so I didn't fancy getting the camera out too much. We've just been let through by a group who were holding us up, so now there's nothing stopping us. 42 points through nine holes as a team, and yours truly has got 19 on his own. One under par. We've only missed one green. One green we've missed, Rich. What? Now, Rich. Hi, you all right? Isn't it funny? Now this morning we're playing and we're thinking never never drinking again. Yep. Never we're never drinking and playing golf again. Yep. Ever. 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 Two pints at lunch, 19 points through a five. Absolutely happy. Can't, can't wait for tonight. Are we gonna share a bottle of red? Well, maybe one or two. Or three or four. four. I'm a Pinot Noir kind of guy. I like a Malbec. And with that, we're gonna get back to the action. Go, go. What a player. Don't you just love good Scottish Lynx golf? Oh. So this place is pretty much as traditional links as it gets. Nine holes out, nine holes back. So I'm not particularly thinking about the score too much because everything's been downwind. We've now turned around, we're into the wind and this is a totally different beast. But it's still pretty beautiful. Turn over. Get a laugh. Turn over. Oh! Oh! Shabby, go in. That's a bit of a bold shout, but. This could be a one. Big. Go, get up. Gotta go, go, go. Oh, oh my god. Oh. It's come off the front. <laughs> That's all right. Too much check it, check it, check it, check it. Zip, 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 zip. Oh, shot. So 
So as I think a lot of you know, I love Lynx golf. Lynx golf is by far my favourite kind of golf. North Berwick is my favourite course in the world, bar none, ever. I absolutely love it. I love how different all the holes are. I love being by the sea. And this is exactly what Royal Dornock offers you as well. Every single hole's different. You're right by the sea. It's always in immaculate condition. What more could you want from a golf course? This place is beautiful. It's definitely up there in my list of golf courses. In fact, I think when I get home, I'm gonna have to write a list because some of the courses I've got to play this year have been pretty special. really starting to tire. Yeah, need a beer. Yeah. Oh, Ripper. Just a bit right, I think. Ripper? Ripper. You've been listening to him, the lads behind us. Ripper! Ripper. Not surfing. No. Come on, Rich, you've done f all day. <laughs> <laughs> There's no you in team. Good strike. There it is. Right, this seems like a pretty good place to ask the question, guys, while we're all together. Lynx golf or inland golf? They're both good. You, you just love ways. golf, don't you? I you just love you're golf. just a golf pair. Yeah. Paul, Lynx golf or inland golf? Bit of both. Bit of... Yeah. I want to play Lynx every day. I'm not going to lie, I really saw that going better. <laughs> So guys, again, hit those comments below. Would you prefer to play inland golf or Lynx golf if you could only choose one for the rest of your life? And don't sit on the fence like these boys. Make a decision. Lads, what do you want for tea? Don't know. Wine. Not bothered. Sir. Wine. Wine. <laughs> Red. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's a golf shot right there. <laughs> Heck yeah. Yeah, that's a golf yep. shot. Nice. You're joking. <laughs> you are having me on. You are having a laugh. What was that? <laughs> Did you put a sponge on your putter or something? I'll, I'll get me caught. <laughs> And so, as the day draws to an end, walking down the 18th fairway, it has been spectacular. It's been wonderful, it's been amazing. We've all played some pretty good golf. And all that's left to do is tot up the scores. After we all birded the 18th, obviously. Well, time to do some totting up. Here they are coming in. Making the scores up as they go along, no doubt. Hey, hey, gentlemen. Gentlemen. Right. gentlemen. Well, let me just finish the car. Do you guys get my... Yeah. Yeah. Oh. 
conversation. Jesus Christ, you know what's going on? Couldn't believe the four of us just had the games of our lives. There was some good stuff. There was some absolute drops. I think you might too. How many of them? Sorry? How many? Listen, I've written it down right there. Right? So I'll close that now. And I won't open that until you. So we've done 83. Oh, you are taking the name. No. 82. Yeah! What did I say before we went oh, out? Oh, whatever you, know, you, you do, that. we beat you by one. <laughs> well, let me finish this thing. Just do another one. Cheers, <laughs> 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 boys. Yeah. 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 Yeah.